28. <laughs> okay. You, you feel pretty good. <sighs> so damn good. All right, so you knock on the door. Yeah. We're closing! <laughs> Can I come in for just a moment? I have a question about something I bought. Uh, fine, come in! Thank you. Oh, hey! Hi. Good to see you! Good to God. see you. Yeah! Do you walk in with? I do. And hello! <laughs> Moro, it is good to see you. No, oh, the pleasure is mine. Mm. <laughs> um, I have a question about yeah. the hair oil that I bought. Oh, you're using it! Yes, I'm I so am. happy! Yes, I've been using it every night for a week now. Ooh. And I didn't know, am I supposed to wash my hair ever or just leave it in? Like, does it just keep building up and up over time, and then all of a sudden my hair grows like a foot? I don't understand. I think that's more of a cultural choice. I tend to leave it in. Okay. But, you know, whatever you want. How do you always? Do you ever wash your the hair? The fragrance is it rather. It just gets in the way. Oh. Oh. Okay. Cool, I was just wondering how to use it. You know, it's the funniest thing. Every time I put it in, Ford is like, you smell so good, you smell so familiar. And I'm like, I smell like Moro, I think. And then he's I like, oh. I was wondering where that smell was, what it was reminding me of. Well, you certainly found the source. No. I, I did, I did. <laughs> I oh, he you. won't shut up about how good he thinks it smells. Yep, it smells really? so good. Just makes my whole body flame tingles galore. Well. Yeah. Now, listen, I, I was wondering, do you have anything around here that a, a feller could drink or, or pour on himself to, I don't know, make someone uh, a fall in love with him? Frumpkin has been on the move for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so all this is happening. <laughs> I'm so proud. Is there, is, all of you. Is there a back yeah. window or anything, a back door? Uh, there is door? not a back. No, uh, there is not a back door. Oh. There is a back window on like the side. There's like there's like a small little room on the side of the main two-story building um, that has a window that is currently closed. I'm gonna go look in it. I'm gonna give not a boost. Thank uh, you. Okay, you don't know where to find not. No, we're I'm pulling invisible. On oh, okay. pulling on your... I thought we were taped. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, it is it is closed, and you go ahead and push on it. It's locked. Can you I'll lock start to it? unlock. Yeah. Okay. So it's latched from the inside. So you go ahead and get your tools out. Go ahead and roll proficiency plus dexterity. One. No. <sighs> Fuck. You get your hook behind there, and you're like, I got it. You pull, pull, and it kind of resists, and it slips out of your fingers, and instead your tool <laughs> on the inside of the building. What oh no. <laughs> you guys are talking and. Moro, I, I don't know how to say this, but I need you. Hold on just a second, well, I'm no, sorry. This is my I just... is, and I, I, I pull my armor open to show my, my old half worn chest. <laughs> 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 I can persuade Jack. I use the thaumaturgy to blow his hair back. Just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> this. Paranoid Goblin is so torn. <laughs> it's like. <laughs> <laughs> well, what you're asking, I maybe don't have much in the way of potions, but oil applications can be helpful. Oh. She rolls her arms up a bit. Loud of my love, <laughs> I need you. Mom. Sweet thing. Who <laughs> gave me her thieves tools? You have keep, thieves tools as well. I keep All right, on me. that's good. I just did one step before and I re-popped that. Singing real loud. Oh god! Oh god! <laughs> Come on! God damn it. Eighteen. Eighteen. Okay. It's not opening. Oh. <gasps> Caleb has gone full Bran Stark and is holding Correct. out to Yasha and Caduceus's arms, and my cat has so been in there for like happened. two minutes by yes. now. Yes, and now at this point, is uh, 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 Moro has gone beneath the counter and is pulling out this kind of a thick salve, like a balm. It's like, but it needs to be applied directly. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys need some privacy? I can wait down here. No, it's fine. Oh. oh I'll just, um. <laughs> like the sun sails, <laughs> here in my eyes. 
Ford, yeah. Ford is quietly, eyes closed, singing to himself, putting his mind know. elsewhere. Uh, Moro right. goes and grabs a stool. <laughs> Just thinking about it. Jumps onto it, to get up, and begins to like apply it on the exposed chest oh. of Ford. Is, how distracted is she? So distracted. I'm pretty distracted right now. Could I just walk backwards over to the window and unlatch it? Uh, the, yes, 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 yes. The room they're going into is not, it's, it's technically, a, it's on the oh, side okay, of the chamber. Okay, okay. Um, you look around and you see there is no back uh, uh, door necessarily. There's a small closet back there and there's a door that leads to what looks to be like a storage chamber of some kind. Um, so at that point, you're not really in a place where you can yeah. Help with that, unfortunately. Um, so, well, this whole time while this is happening, Fuck. three minutes later. Yes, Caleb. Fucking doors. Into the house. Pete, Investigation check. What are you looking for? I want the lay of the entire building and see if anything is. Oh, perception old. check, though. Perception check. Yeah. Okay. And we'll also be casting Mage Hand. Okay. Right. I also kind of described where I was seeing the glow from. I did my best to kind of give him a sense of where I saw a weird glow last time. Yeah, the glow is in the far, the far back corner. So if you're facing from the front door inward. There is a countertop where Moro is stationed there. There are two tables that kind of flank the sides, and there's just shit on the walls and boxes and empty things everywhere. And then there is the spiral staircase towards the back uh, that leads upward to the second floor. The, um, uh, or like kind of on the, on, on the side back yeah. of the chamber. The glow you recall was in the far back corner. Yeah. Um, 22. 22. All right, so you note, you know, through, uh, through Frumpkin, notice the entire layout of the interior of this chamber, everyone's location. Uh, there is the closed door on the far back, uh, and then kind of behind where they all are, and there is the spiral staircase that leads up to the secondary floor. Mm. Okay, of course. Up, yeah. up, up to the staircase, yeah. there is a door there. It is closed. Hmm. That's the end of the rope for me. End of the road. Uh, can Frumpkin peer? Is there a crack? Is there any kind of uh, slit at the bottom? Uh, with the perception check you rolled, uh, mm -hmm. there is, but there's no light. Yeah. Um, so roll perception with disadvantage. Yeah, okay. Terrible. Both terrible. Uh, seven. Yeah, I should just seven. go in and kill everybody. Can't really get a view. Fortunately, mm -hmm. the space is a little too thin. Mm -hmm. Frumpkin can't quite get an eye around. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to try Mage Hand. Okay. Just sort of blindly. Flick to try to open. It doesn't have to be within sight. It can be any point within range. You can probably see through it since any it's a window. It says at any point you choose within range. Doesn't have to have a line of sight. That's true. Okay. All right. But I won't know what I'm doing. Nope. So it's I need you to be make, blindly I need trying you to make a sleight of hand check without thieves' tools. So just strap just bra. A, a straight dexterity check with disadvantage. Huh? Straight. Straight dexterity, dexterity check with disadvantage. With disadvantage. Correct, because you can't see it. Okay, I rolled a 17 and a 16. Yeah. Both plus five, both over 20. <laughs> oh, oh, what the heck? Uh, lucky rolls. Eyes, but she's invisible. Yep. <laughs> uh, no, <laughs> not the back yet. of the head. You're visible. I, I cast That's right, you cast Mage Hand. Oh, oh. But I'll cast Invisibility again. Okay. Okay. I give her a boost through the window and then I okay. go in. Stealthily as fuck. Goggles on. Okay. You both quietly make it your way right in. Um, this is a storage chamber. The smell is extremely strong. Um, all the scents that, that were inside the building when you were there last time um, tripled in pungency and intensity. Uh, all sorts of mildewed, uh, composting earthen type smells. Um, there are a number of small boxes and chests that are locked, um, and there's the door to the right. And you can hear Ford singing through the doorway. I knew when I saw you. Okay, I'm looking and for, you place uh, it along the sternum? I'm just watching <laughs> kind of with heart eyes as I'm watching Ford get oiled up. Let all <laughs> Correspondence, letters, oh mail. God. Investigation. Jester with a sweaty upper lip. How <laughs> <laughs> this, this room that we're in? oily like air. 15 like feet by 15 feet. Okay. Right, on Napoleon Dynamite. Slow mo. <laughs> Roll a wand in you. I just died in your last house. 11. Are you helping with this team? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm looking around as well. Yeah. All right, so message. <laughs> Please <laughs> roll better than me. Uh, 24. Okay. 24. Oh okay. <laughs> looking around the room, you don't find any correspondence. Uh, there's no papers kept in here. Uh, you do find there are a lot of. Boxes that are chained and locked. 
um, of different sizes, different qualities. Um, half of the room appears to be materials for use in the creation of these uh, these Things. potions, chemicals, bombs, and such. And there are looks to be they're broken apart a few alchemical supply kits that are probably used, not well taken care of in the creation of these. Um, but then apart from that, in those supplies, there are these, you know, this wide variety of different size boxes. Some some wooden, some metal, some like, you know, iron. Did There's like a small silver box. Written on them, Rhino are these fat, signs? Ostrich fat. That they've yeah. been making oh. dunamancy back here? Uh, nothing that seems to catch your attention there. I'm going to um, oh, I'm sorry. They are locked. I'm going to point to the fr- towards the front of the the thing, hold the wire up to my lips and say, Mr. Clay, Mr. Clay, come back here right away as fast as you can to the back of the house. 